Hi guys, and welcome to the new lesson. Um, today we've got something a little bit special. Um, we've put together this blues piece, which is going to sort of be a chronological look at the blues. Um, we're going to sort of move through um, from the Delta into the Chicago sound, into the sort of British blues kind of boom, and how that influenced a lot of rock music that was to come. Uh, and also sort of beyond that, and sort of where we are today, where a lot of players are, are really sort of trying to keep that tradition alive. They're, they're not sort of trying to evolve too much with it. They're sort of trying to keep that that traditional message that the blues had in the Delta and the, and the, and the sort of Chicago sound um, and sort of bring that back with players like Derek Trucks and Robin Ford and people like that. Um, so obviously with this, the interesting part when I put this together was that the music obviously is blues and the vocabulary for blues can, can seem quite simple at times. Um, but obviously the way that you tell that message is really the thing that creates that uniqueness in a player. Um, the technology is a big part of that as well. You'll notice that obviously we started with acoustic guitar with the introduction of the electric guitar, that really sort of took it somewhere new because we had a lot more ability with the electric guitar to manipulate the sounds differently. Um, and obviously with that, the amplification obviously came along as well and that influenced it even more with uh, a lot more sustain, a lot more body in our sound of the guitar. Um, so it's kind of interesting to see how that kind of moved on um, and obviously we took it to quite uh, an extreme with obviously uh, where, where rock music has gone really, you know, to start off at that Delta place and sort of move on. Um, it's nice to see that a lot of the players that are sort of towards the back end of this song, um, you'll notice a lot of the players are sort of hinting back at that tradition again. So that's quite nice to see that there's people keeping that sort of original message alive, which is cool. So um, I hope you enjoyed it. Um, I really hope we do a few more of these in the future. Um, but obviously I do understand there are many, many great blues artists out there. Um, this is just a very small selection of them. Um, but I hope it's, it sort of tells a little bit of the story of where the blues has come from and where it's going.